When simplifying radicals, we need to determine the largest perfect square factor. And the preferred method is to use mental math, but sometimes you need the help of the calculator. So today I'll show you how to find, how to simplify the square root of 128 using the graphing calculator. So the first thing I want to do is set my table to 1. I want it to start counting at 1. So second table graph, I'm looking here, my table is starting at 78. I need it to start at 1. So up here below, above the window key is table set. So hit second, table set, and I'm going to start it at 1. All right now I can go into y equals, and I'm trying to find the factors of 128. So I type 128 divided by x, whatever number I'm trying to find the factors of, divided by x. Then I'm going to arrow down to y2 and type in x squared, because I want a list of my perfect squares. So now let's look at our table, second graph or second table. And the first two columns are the factors of 128, 1 and uh, 128, 2 and 64, 4 and 32, 8 and 16. And in Y2, I have a list of the perfect squares. So I'm going to start at the top of Y1, and I'm going to start down until I find a perfect square. And right away I did, 64. So the largest perfect square factor of 128 is 64. So I'm going to use the factors of 2 and 64 to simplify the radical. So if I have the square root of 128, I can rewrite that as the square root of 64 times the square root of 2, which I can simplify as 8 square roots of 2.